and it's full of little details to this day you can see there was a there's one there should be a little oh, there it is there look that's often missed out when people restore them this the line that continues there and that was a, a little chased line with a little chaser onto the body you see it it allows, it's, yeah, it's that, like yeah just, just, no, no, just uh, there should be, as there is there, just a, a semblance of that line continuing off yes. of there, you know. But uh, up here was quite tricky. That's all built up with gas weld there. And there was levers in there. There's ash underneath here, wood, wood, a wooden frame. Well, that's quite a deep um, yeah. trough. Yeah, so, there. so it, was, it, it was worked over on the panel fixing line. And it was a guy called Fat Jack uh, I used to work <laughs> with. And he'd, he'd, he'd been... Um, he used to drive a Churchill tank. That's where that was his background, you know, as a young man. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, in, yeah. Real, in, in real life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So Not fact, just as a so, hobby. So, so he'd be there, maybe say fixing these. Are, these are solid, riveted on these arches underneath. Not the not the trim, but the actual yeah. arch. And uh, he'd be down there, and as an apprentice, you had to hold up things for him. And he smoked this dreadful pipe. And you know, it's when you could smoke inside. So he'd be like. Yeah, yeah. Was everyone smoking in the factory? Oh, yeah. Yeah, people were smoking in the factory. You know? Yes. And once again, it's a, uh, you got through the day, I guess. I, yeah, don't smoke, yeah. I don't smoke, but, you know, yeah, people, yeah. people did. Yeah. But once again, you, I know where the welds are. Yeah, just move to from, the from memory. Yeah. Yeah, there's a, the welds through here. There's all sorts of welds up the back. There's a weld that runs through here. And this is a standard uh, rear light on here, but they, there were available extras of a recessed rear light on there as well. Underneath here, there's an aluminium frame, which this is all clinched on, over. And these boot panels, there's a weld that runs all the way across there. And that's in there's a... two pieces. Yeah, there's two pieces. So it allows you to wheel two pieces Would up. Would one person uh, be specialist in boots? Not really, but... Arthur, you could all make... Yeah, but Arthur either. Noyes was insistent that he was the rear wingman. So King Arthur was left alone. You know, that, yeah. they just they, they just knew they just they sort of you weren't just, going just, to just, argue. just let Arthur carry on with his um, with his would wings. Would that have been one of the most difficult pieces to make, or would the uh, I I think the, the front wings were the most difficult there. Yeah, but the panel fixing was another thing that went onto a line. The panel fixing was was quite difficult. Panel fixing yeah. is not is that's fitting the panels onto the inner so structure. that everything coordinates. Yeah, there's a there's a there's a lot of skills in that as well. You know, and I presume. Can you hang the panels to see, and then? Uh, well, they were done on on the, a buck, or you know, a, pat, a huge pattern that looked like a car. Yeah. So they fitted that. They fitted to a provisional size, yeah. and then they were tailored to the actual. And was car. the Phantom still around when you were final check? Uh, final inspector, yeah. Final inspector. Yeah. I think they, there was. A, I think it probably stopped about the time that I actually left in 1990 or thereabouts. Probably, yeah. 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 But so, I mean, how long would it take you to check a phantom? Or were you continuously... It, it were two of us. Up. There was a guy called Bill Watts, an older man, because uh, he, he, he always wanted to be the phantom man, you know, but he let me come along for the... For the to for learn. The, yeah, to learn. <laughs> yeah. On there. yeah, he used to have a uh, talk about his days. He had a Vincent motorcycle. There was these characters there, so he was littered uh, uh, They must characters. have all been characters. Here, we'll move yeah. back up towards the front, so we have this... Just a quickie, underneath yeah. here, oh, yeah, one of the apprentices' jobs in the bare metal... Uh, to seal the underside of the panel, because once we've welded them, we had to get the corrosive flux off in boil it with boiling water. Then What's there, corrosive flux? Well, to join aluminium, you have to gas when you gas weld it. Use a flux, you know, to break down. Which is that kind of grease sort of thing? No, no, no. It's, no. it's a it's a, a white powder that you make into a, 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 a paste. paste and you paint it on, and that attacks the. Uh, the surface oxide of the aluminium, which is omnipresent and that melts at a higher temperature than the base material. Okay. So without that, it's gone. It's gone. Yeah, so, so the flux is the thing that brings it together. So you have um, one moment if you get it wrong. Well, it was a series of tacks. Then you cleaned it. Then you wheeled it through once just to get the get it in line. And then uh, Dicky Foot was a fabulous welder. You know, he just you could go along there with hardly any uh, filler material and create a beautiful weld with penetration. And then the apprentice would wash it off with the boiling water. But when we finished and it was that shape and it was filed up because that had a file across it, you know, to get the shape, the underside, we had this stuff called gold size. And it's what you use for when you're using gold leaf. You know, yeah. It's like that, that yeah. adhesive. Sort. So the aluminium is sealed with gold size. There was an apprentice job, you know, go and do four of those. And it's just painting like a, like a varnish. It looked like a varnish. Yeah. I, I didn't know what it was for. It was just called gold size. I thought it was the, the brand name yeah. of it. But yeah. it's what you use in gold leafing, you know. And that's that. They're all uh, sealed underneath with that. And is that what they, they? So they would have made say four boots at a time. They they wouldn't yeah. have just made a phantom. 
throughout. No, no, there would have like been bits and pieces. One thing. No, there would have been. would have made three or four. Yeah, or yeah, because. It, it, you, were you building that many of them? I mean, were there enough of them? Not really. No, not not many at all. Really. I don't know how many a year someone. Would. I mean, at, at one stage, you could only buy a phantom if you were prime minister, head of state, royalty, and then they allowed film stars right. and. Well, they did Sophie Loren's one there, didn't they? With a, a white leather interior. Bill Watts inspected that when, and he said that we couldn't give a guarantee because she insisted on white leather. We wouldn't guarantee the colour the color fast of the, the white leather. Really? Yeah, because she was advised against it. Yeah. Yeah, because he, he, he was much older than me, so he told me yeah. all those, those stories. But they, um, yeah, the, the, the Phantom was, the, there's a, it, they, they had the best of the best working on the Phantom. Yes. Yeah. Let's yeah. see now. And <clears throat> What about, I, I thought you were going to say the hardest one, because there were one or two phantoms that were yep. landolettes. Yep. So that would have been yep. chopped from about here. Yep. Well, don't forget, a lot of that would have been done by the body fitters up adjacent to the trim department. So that the metal work, it, it, it was neither here nor there. You know, that, uh, the, the body makers on the top floor would have put the, those mechanisms in and trimmed it. So that, okay. was, that was the hard job, whereas we would have supplied Oh, you are building it rather yeah, than taking it Yeah, but I th I, from memory, I think the experimental department were involved in those as well. And then, of course... And now, say, for interiors, mm -hmm. that would have been the next stage after... That was upstairs. You.